Hello, fellow engineers, and welcome back to the game that still hasn't been copyright takedowned. It's Bloons FPS. I mean, it's Apes versus Helium. Completely original and different. Anyway, last time we played Ape Meadow, very similar to the Bloons TD6 first level, but I've been told to play Tropical Island. And I'm going to have a go on hard mode because I think I'm hard. Too much information. All right, so this one apparently is different in that when we start the round, yeah, we're surrounded by Bloons. So there's Bloons over that way. There's Bloons way over in the distance over there. And you'll notice they're not following a track. They literally just seek me. They're monkey-seeking balloons. Uh, so we got to be a bit more careful. This is going to be a lot more FPS-ish than the last one. The last one, because they followed the track, it was very tower defense still. Uh, and I'm an old man now with very slow reactions. So we'll see how this goes. <laughs> anyway, after a bit more popping of balloons, that's round two completed. We got 258 quid. Now, ideally, I want to get the, the banana farm as soon as possible. That's 1,350 so I'm wondering, is it worth doing an upgrade first just to make myself a little bit stronger? And I mean, for now, I'm just going to I'm gonna spawn kill as they come out the tubes. But uh, oh no, we've got we've got blue balloons. Uh, they contain red balloons inside, so we've got to be careful of those. But yeah, that round wasn't too bad. We're up to 396 quid. Still got 100 lives. I'm going to keep on going. All right, so I'll just pop these. I need to be careful behind me. Ah, yeah, I just got hit. I just got hit in the ass. They snuck up on me. Well, this is very different to the last round I played. I mean, hopefully we can we can just lure them around in like a big circle. As long as I look behind me before I move, we should be fine. Get back. Get back. Get back, you savages. All right, we're up to 570 quid. I feel like it might be it might be too long to wait for the banana tree. I've decided to gamble and do one more round. I'm sure it'll be fine. I think this round is just blue balloons, which is actually, they're quite hard to see. They're sort of camouflaged on the horizon. Thankfully, when they're popped, they do turn into the red ones. So a little bit easier to see. All right, and then we'll do the next round, which now has green balloons. They have blue ones inside. Oh, and they're faster and they are faster. And then it's just a case of killing everyone. I want, can I, oh, I can, I can go for a swim. Can they, oh no, they can breathe underwater. They can breathe underwater. <laughs> it's okay though. Very, very soon we will be able to afford you. We're just a hundred quid off. So after this round, we should be good. Time to spawn kill some balloons. Oh man, there's a lot of greens. There is a lot of greens. But we're fine. And just like that, we have enough money to plant a banana tree. Yummy. Oh my goodness, there's so many on the horizon. <laughs> there's so many. <laughs> well, it's actually kind of freaky. I feel like if you were like, if you had like a phobia of balloons... This game would literally be terrifying. Like, if these were architects, I'd be absolutely bricking it right now. Imagine this many architects running towards you. It'd be hideous. But we've just about finished the round, which means the banana has dropped some bananas, which if we pick up are worth some cash. And then we're up to 642 quid, which I should probably use to upgrade myself. I could perhaps try out some of these other weapons, like the sniper but because I'm an idiot, I'm going to come and upgrade my banana farm. So we go again with absolutely no upgrades to my dark gun. Ow, I just ran into one. Oh, I lost another bit of health. Still, the round is over, so we can pick up the bananas. And there's twice as many now, which means we're up to 590 quid. And I think that means I'm going to upgrade myself. We are now a sniper monkey. Boosh. <laughs> oh, man, it's really slow firing. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> So yeah, a lot more powerful, but a lot slower firing. Not ideal. Um, however, the scope, not just there for show. Look. Boosh, 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 boosh. <laughs> however, my youth taught me that using a gun like this is all about 360 no scope. Nope. 360 no scope. Nope. Oh, I keep missing. 360 no scope. Yes. <laughs> right, and the beauty of the sniper, I can be like completely safe over this side of the island and I can just pick them off from a distance. So we get a load of bananas. I've actually got enough money to upgrade the tree again. I really, I really want faster shooting, but... Oh, well. All right, so I'm feeling quite surrounded looking on the horizon. I think we'll be fine, though. I've just got to, just got to like, clump them all up so they all follow me. And then it's just the slow process of thinning the herd one by one. I, I could really do... I don't think these do any piercing. Yes, yeah, it's going to take a while, but at least it gives me time to practice my 360 no scope. The one good thing about the sniper is it does get rid of the blues in one hit. Like, the same as the reds. So at least the blues don't actually contain reds anymore. But that round is done. I got 737 quid to spend. So we can give ourselves faster firing. And then we can't quite afford full metal jacket. Yeah, but hopefully the faster firing will help us. I mean, not gonna lie. It doesn't seem that much faster. I guess it is a little bit faster. But oh no. Oh no. There's yellows on this one. Yellows are fast. Yellows are fast. All right, come on, you yellow scumbag. Boosh. <laughs> 
All right, and then back to a game of patience where I just have to spend five minutes popping all of these one by one. Oh, there we go. So we'll pick up the bananas. We'll look at our total, 964. And then we can buy the full metal jacket, which I think allows us to kill up to yellows in one hit. That's what I'm hoping anyway. And then we'll get even faster firing. Oh, which actually is faster. Okay, that's, that's quite good. Question is, does it kill yellow? Yes, it kills yellows in one hit as well. Does it kill pinks? No, it doesn't kill pinks in one hit. Oh my god, it's so fast. Run away, run away. <laughs> right, yellows are still very fast as well. So we've got to watch those. But yeah, nice we kill greens in one hit. And also we've got we got some sort of penetration. We are popping multiple balloons. That was so much quicker. Oh, and we have a very nice amount of money. Anyway, we'll grab those bananas. We've got 820. Is that enough for the tax shooter? No, I need 864. More shooting. And the full caliber ammo that's doing a bit of penetration. That's really, really, really helped. Uh, did that round in no time. I think if we put a tax shooter somewhere in the middle like that, that should help us out massively. Oh, and we have regrow balloons. The hearts are more dangerous than they look. Uh, but if I stand here, my tax helping me and the bananas are dropping. Yay! Which means straight onto another round. Like if I stand here, they should go straight into it because they're stupid balloons. They're the architect of party objects but yeah doing my loop around the tax shooter this is much quicker so time to upgrade to large caliber which i think means we can take out up to the zebra or the maybe the rainbow balloons in one hit so i think we definitely want that yeah we can now take out the pinks uh, which is very good because they're so fast <laughs> yeah for the rest i'll just snipe them from here and then my tax shooter can do some collateral and then we're good all right so this round we've we've just got these little black balloons and they're they're one hit kills they're only one hit kills if I kill them. If the tack guy kills them, they split into smaller balloons. So that's something to remember. Oh my god, the, <laughs> the pinks got so close. There's so many pinks. All right, thankfully, I think we're good. This sniper's actually really good now. All right, so another round. We've got a white balloon. That did not last long. Couple there. Oh, they turned into pinks. Damn you, tack shooter. No, tack shooter, you're making it worse. You're making it worse. We're meant to be working together. Right, so not always worth attracting balloons to the tax shooter. You definitely cocked me up there, mate. Thankfully, we prefer these rounds because my high caliber bullets are piercing straight through them. Now we got 3,699 quid. Let's upgrade the banana plantation. Boosh, we have four trunks. Oh, looks like we're back to somewhat normal balloons this time. Oh, there's camo. There's camo. Did you see that? Oh, we've got to be careful. We've got to be careful. There's invisible balloons. All right, thankfully, we did take him down. I think that means I should probably go by... The camo detection, 648 quid, but I think it's well spent. Ow, and I just lost a life because these guys are blooming fast. Got to get back to my tax shooter. I mean, by the time I'm back, I have just killed them all. Let's get some more tax. And then we go again. Oh no, loads of pinks, loads of pinks and yellows. Oh, and this time we have the zebras, which thankfully I can destroy in one shot. So we'll make my tax shooter shoot faster. Get a little bit swamped. Oh no, there's, there's getting, oh, there's more coming out. There's yellows. There's gonna be, are there going to be pinks? There might be pinks. Oh, man, there's so many. Oh, the sniper is not good for this. Thankfully, running backwards in circles around the island seems to be a good tactic. Particularly if I make them all fly through the tack shooter. Yeah, that's right. This way, this way, little guys. All right, so this one has these white ones that pop into loads of greens. Uh, thankfully, though, pretty easy round. So let's eat some more bananas and then turn our tack shooter into a tack sprayer. Oh, hello, big red boy. Oh god, I'm swamped. I'm swamped by yellows. There's so many yellows. <laughs> right, here we go. Here we go. Yes. Yes, that is that is how we do it. That is how we do it. All right, so we've got more of these ones that pop into different colors. That's fine. Now, attack sprayer seems to be coping with them pretty well. Ow, although one just hit me in the gonads there. I'm down to 95 health. And we have enough money to gain some deadly precision. Now, this sort of looks like we're going to be headshotting coconuts. Oh, but look at my sniper. It's so red. It's got a red scope. I don't actually know what deadly precision does. Does it mean like I can shoot over there? No. <laughs> I thought it might like auto aim. Not quite sure what it does, if I'm honest. All right, this round is loads of camos. We have the camo detection, so this isn't really hard, if I'm honest. All right, this round is a little bit scary. Lots and lots of yellows. Lots of yellows. <laughs> oh, they just keep on coming. But we're back to the safety of the tack shooter, which should thin the herd pretty well. And then we can eat more yummy bananas. I'll tell you what, since I am getting swamped so much at the start, I might actually get the monkey ace to help me out. So we'll give him rapid fire. And we can't quite give him more darts, but we will do that soon. 
that you can see him flying around now. So as we as we spawn these guys, he is spawn killing. Ow, I just got nailed. I just got nailed. I was distracted by the plane. I got stuck on a tree. I'm stuck on a tree. Ow. Ow. Oh, it wasn't a tree. It was a bloody shop. Oh, I'm down to 75 health. Oh, that was really bad. That was really bad. That is the trouble with running backwards. You uh, you can't see where you're going. I think they're going to give my plane guy a lot more darts. And I'm going to get a regrow blocker as well. Which means round 35 isn't as stressful as it would have been. <laughs> Try telling that to my brain right now. And that's it, Tax Shooter. Help me out. Help me out. All right, time to overdrive the Tax Shooter. I feel like it needs to help out a little bit more. And this will give it the perfect opportunity to prove itself. Go on then, Tax Shooter. Have a, have a blast. Have a blast. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That was money well spent. All right, this time we have the boss. We have the Moab. And unfortunately, I don't have the Moab thing, although we did take it down very, very quickly. And then the ceramics, one hit kills. But yeah, now we've got five grand. A level too late, but let's get the meme Moab, which means when we next see one, we'll take it down very, very quickly. But for now, I've just got to lure these guys back to my attack shooter. There we go. Oh, you make things so much easier, attack shooter. I do, I do like you. That a boy. That a boy. There he goes. There he goes. Now, I sort of want to pop all these ones that contain loads of balloons myself. Because uh, I can one-hit kill them. Whereas the tack shooter and the plane, they turn them into lots of other balloons which are a lot faster. Meaning I have to run away like an architect. Anyway, back to the safety of the tack shooter. There we go. There we go. Then snipe you, whatever you are. And eat up the bananas. We're up to 11 grand. I think I'm going to save up for the super bananas now. 18,000 quid we need. So that's going to be a few more rounds yet. Uh, thankfully, if I can destroy these before the other balloons get to them, they shouldn't pop. Oh, no, that one pops. That one popped. <laughs> All right, I've just purchased the super bananas as well just before the end of the round, which means, yes, we get more money that time. So they basically give us three, three grand, three and a half grand. And this level has a lot of greens. What is going? Why are there so many greens? Oh, no, now they've turned into zebra. And oh, no, there's all sorts coming out. There's all sorts coming out. Go on, tax shooters. Thin them out. Thin them out for me. I'll try and take out the big boys. Ah, and the ones in my face. <laughs> oh, man. The tack the tack might need upgrading. It didn't do a great job there, if I'm honest. And thankfully, once we pick these up, we're up to 11 grand already. But we need 22 if we're going to enter the tack zone. Oh, I've just realized, actually, maybe I should have gone with the bottom route on the sniper. I went top with the coconut head shooter and the Moabs. Perhaps I should have gone bottom to get a full auto rifle. I mean, I can I can sell my sniper and buy it again. I'm going to do that. So unlock all these. We're going to get semi-automatic, then fully automatic. And the next upgrade will be elite defender. So let's see when we start this round. How? Oh, look how fast it is. Okay, this could make things a little bit easier. I mean, it may not be as powerful, and we do now have Moabs to try and kill, but uh, look how fast we're shooting. <laughs> yeah, I haven't really had to herd around some attack shooter. I mean, I may as well now, but uh, that is so much better. Yeah, you even do fully automatic while looking down the scope as well. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, wow. Lots of balloons in this round. Lots of balloons in this round. Pretty manic. All right, so that's most of them down, I reckon. So we'll take out a Moab now. There's one down. There's the other one down. I was getting closer. <laughs> yeah, just like that, we're done. Don't worry, Mr. Monkey. I won't shoot you. Because I need you to enter the attack zone. All right, so now this thing it should be an absolute beast. And I'm hoping I can stay fairly close to it and uh, not take too much damage. We got some Moabs this time. So let's muller this one. I can single-handedly defend myself against a Moab. But yeah, this guy sure is helping now. <laughs> what a beast. All right, come on, tack shooter. Yeah, it's so good. It is so good now. And it needs to be because these balloons sure do sneak up fast. Every one of these brown ones I pop, I think they're ceramics. But uh, Mr. Tack Shooter absolutely plows through them. Yeah, good investment, you were. And at round 56, we got 28 grand, which means time to make ourselves an elite defender. Oh, man, look at the girth of my barrel now. As a right chunker. Oh, look how fast it is. What? It's got no recoil either. Okay, now I feel like I'm cheating. I feel like this shoots faster than the minigun did. <laughs> and it has a scope on it. Yeah, this is insane. <laughs> Even the Moabs get just mullered in seconds. Particularly when I get my tack shooter involved. Yeah, despite loads and loads of balloons flying at me. Uh, we are flying through the rounds. We've just completed round 59. 
And I think round 60, that usually, that has a boss, right? Like the medium difficulty boss. Yep, there he is. Take him down. So he burst into four Moabs, which we can deal with pretty quick. Can I do this without moving? No, I had to move a little bit. But, <laughs> oh, we are so overpowered. All right, now we've got 38 grand. So I'm going to make myself even more powerful. I'm going to unlock the Spectre. Now that basically makes the guy in the sky absolutely invincible. I pretty much don't have to do anything. Oh, wow. We've got reinforced Moabs. They're big boys. They are big boys. Okay, yeah. Rounds have got a little bit harder. So, sort of pleased I got the Spectre upgrade. Still, no match for us. Oh, guys. There's a lot of balloons on this level. There are a lot of balloons. They're off to me. Get back. All right. Time to play somewhat tactically again. Let's get my tax shooter back involved. There we go. Back to the safety of being invincible again. But yeah, round 64 is easy. We got 42 grand. I mean, I could buy the little tank, dude. I can probably upgrade him quite a long way. So let's see how far we can get. I tell you what, you come down here and then you can spawn kill these guys. So we'll start you there. Good job. Good job. You know, I'll stand by the tax shooter to draw them all over there from the other end. And ah, I just got hit. I just got hit. Oh, this level got out of hand quickly. <laughs> We've got the super big boys. They're so big. <laughs> right, so yeah, back over here. A little bit closer. There we go. Right, spawn kill those. Oh god, oh god. There's so many. But well, we passed the level. We're on to the next level. Quite a few big boys. But to be honest, yeah, we are we are smashing this. Oh, that is a big one. <laughs> take it down. Take it down. There you go. There you go. All right. I feel you are letting the team down. All right. I tell you what. What if I give you a battle tank? Will that cheer you up? Okay. You do look pretty badass with the old red eye as well. Look at that. Look at the color scheme there. Right. Come over here. All right. Remember, as, as we did in training, born kill. Okay. Yeah. He's way better now. <laughs> He is way better now. Okay, sweet. Yo, save some for the rest of us, man. All right, this is going better again. This is going better, finally. Oh, that is a lot of... That is a lot of those, though. And uh, Ah! Ah! Balloons everywhere. Oh, that was a little bit too close, though. That was... That was scary. Anyway, waves are going down fairly nicely. They just start with such carnage. It's really, really scary. I got 55 grand. I'm sort of think. I don't think I can upgrade anything. Uh, but I might swap my weapon. I'm not sure this is the right weapon for the job. I mean, it's good, don't get me wrong. But uh, perhaps there's another route I want to go. Because, uh, ah, things are getting out of control. Yeah, I'm up to 72 grand. I might just have a little a little sneak peek in the shop. Perhaps I could go Super Monkey and get the Sun God. I think I need quite a bit for that, though. I don't want to, I don't want to, like, underpower myself. So let's see one more round. Safety first. Oh, God, oh, God. That is not safe. That is not safe. <laughs> All right, thin the herd first, Matt. Thin the herd. All right, now focus on the big boys. All right, one more round, then I'll try it. Because look, we've nearly got 100 grand. So sell what I got. Buy super monkeys. Get the sun avatar and the sun god. Really? That's how we shoot, is it? Okay, I'm glad I didn't do that too early on. Although it is very, very... <laughs> it's very effective whilst also blinding me. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to have a migraine for the rest of the day. But uh, apart from that, it went pretty well. Oh, God. <laughs> There's so many big boys. Ow, ow. I lost two hearts. I lost two hearts. I got cocky. But we're finally on to the final round. Round 80. So imagine this is going to be a big boss somewhere. Uh, usually that's what happens anyway. Just one spawns. So let's give that a go. Yes, the zomb. It's the zomger. The zomb. Oh, my goodness. It's huge. Yeah, but to be fair, pretty easy compared to the rounds we've just had before that. Yeah, easy, mate. Easy. And we got another victory. Chalk that up as a monkey win. Peace, love, and snipers. Bye.